it all tastes better if this man is cooking. Don Howie, <laughs> one of the best known chefs in all we, of Washington State. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, thanks so much for joining us. You're here for a very special reason. Yeah, I was going to say, you and uh, teammates, including Seahawks, uh, oh my gosh. Walter, Walter Jones. Walter Jones, yes, and our King Five analyst, by the way. Yeah. So you've been yeah. taking a part of this Kick Hunger Challenge for a while. So can you tell Ever us a little bit about that? Ever since it started. Yeah. So Taste of the NFL started 16, well, started 28 years ago, okay. and I've been doing it for the Seahawks for 16 years. Oh my gosh. Eight years ago, they started the Kick Hunger challenge where all the teams compete against each other to raise money for their local food banks. Okay. So since then, we've won it four times. Yes. We need one for the thumb this year. <laughs> and we've only we placed second three times. Okay. So our biggest rival has been the Patriots. Really? They have a good chef that they send in every huh. year. They do, but he's pretty much <clears throat> out of the competition now. Oh, we good. Believe. You know, I mean, they don't have, how they do theirs is a raffle. Okay. And they're oh. not going to be able to raffle uh, tickets to the AFC Championship game this year. And so what do you guys bring to the table? So do you try to bring a Seattle, you know, centric menu, or is it just something that you whip up out of your, you know, your mind? So we do, we do three events. One is the poker event, which is held in May or early June. Mm -hmm. Then we do the Taste of the Seahawks in November. And then we have this auction event. And so for the auction, we take where the Super Bowl city is going to be. This year it's Miami. Mm -hmm. And we try to do food that's Miami-style Miami. food. Okay, so yeah, what do you okay. think, Michelle? What's a Miami? I'm trying to think of Miami I don't know, food. like fresh fish? I have no idea. Uh, we like, do have mahi-mahi with yeah, papaya okay. salsa. There we go. Yeah, and okay. coconut, uh, uh, coconut rice with red beans. And we've got ah. ceviche. And we've got some jerk chicken. And key lime uh, tartlets. Oh, Very key lime. smart. Yeah, the key lime always works really well. Some coconut cookies. A, a, a few other things as well, but it's a really great experience. So come in and have some great food, some great drinks. And then we have awesome auction items as well. Okay, so, and then who benefits yeah. from it? You so, said locally, but who? Food who, Lifeline. Food, okay. food Lifeline gets every dollar, and because Microsoft is our presenting sponsor, they pay for all the costs. So Food Lifeline, every dollar we raise today, or tomorrow, is every ticket sold is worth now 375 meals. Wow. It's wow. a $75 ticket. They get five meals out of every dollar that's raised. So that's every dollar in the auction, everything is five meals to local Washington hungry neighbors. So you talked about tomorrow night in Bellevue. What is the event and how can people get involved? Okay, so we've got an event tomorrow night which is the Kick Hunger Challenge dinner auction. It's mm -hmm. our last event of the year. We've already raised a bunch of money in the other two and the person who raises the most gets an extra 10,000 from the Taste of the NFL for oh, their so food nice. bank. So that's what we're shooting for. And it's a dinner auction where we have drinks and, and dinner and wonderful auction items. We have stuff from NHL Seattle. They sent us a package for 12 people to visit with the president and CEO and take a tour. Cool. Awesome stuff. Yeah. We've got Walter taking people through uh, spring training. And we've got uh, a Mariners package. Everybody stepped in. It's yeah. really awesome. Oh, my gosh. And then we've got really great food and beverage things as well. But people can get in by buying a ticket for tomorrow night. There's still a few left. Uh -huh. And I think you have a link on, on the line. We do right it. now. If you text the word hunger right to that number, then we'll send you a link. Perfect. There's a few tickets left, and it's it's a really fun experience. So last year we missed it because I closed a sport restaurant and we did it there. Uh -huh. But this year we brought it back, and it's at Sea Star. So. Oh, right. wonderful. Quick question. What is the key to a great key lime yeah. pie? Yeah, and can we start eating? Yes, you can. Shall we? <laughs> yeah, can we Steve look at this? Steve was me he might be able to get down eight of these while you're talking to me. During the interview. <laughs> So it's using key lime juice instead of regular lime juice. So Nellie and okay. Joe's is what we use. Okay. And then making a very thin, oh, come oh, on in and help, right. yeah. I'm so, so rude, I just <laughs> ate the whole thing without you talking. <laughs> and so it's it, the tartness of the key lime with a little mm. bit of semi-sweet vanilla cream on top and then that uh, graham cracker crust. I love that you so. share your secrets. Wow. I expected you to be like, I'm not telling you anything. There might be a secret <laughs> ingredient Ooh. he didn't mention. Oh, oh then one Jordan grew up in Florida, so there yeah. you go. I love key lime, yeah. I didn't mean to sell you short. One of the top chefs in the country. We're so honored to have you here well, in studio. And you're doing this you, for a great chef. cause once again. Good luck. Thanks. And we're we're we, going to uh, get him this year, I think. <laughs> and this is fantastic. Yeah.